bland as hell. I don't want to play her, but what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I didn't really say anything. I like Vince's uh, scenario enough not to say anything, so. Vince has been the okay. best. Russell was Not still one. pretty good. A snake for a tongue. You are so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? Bonnie, 220 days in. Are the claws lobster size or human size? Human size? And make this easy on you. Well... I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Neither? That's not really an answer. You don't set the rules around here. Well, that's a fact. Okay. How about... Oh, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. Well, uh, you gotta admit anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. What I mean is, I mean, you were, you were, uh, you know. Thanks, jerk. Hey, that's what I'm here for. Oh, to remind me how hideous I was. Nah, make sure you keep on keeping on. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but... Well, you've come a long way, Bonnie. And I'm proud of you. Yeah, I'm a real poster child. I could see you on a brochure. Oh, like the ones at the dentist? Before and after, with the puffy face and the yellow teeth? Just look at her now. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? What are you saying? Bonnie, uh... Leland? Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. I found us something. What are you two up a to? A cheater. Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? Oh, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters. Well, fishing. Figured it'd be worth a shot. For the food, you know. Leland, you hate fishing. That ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. Thought you, didn't I? I am a catch. Don't I know it. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your, uh, girlfriend, but, uh, we gotta get moving. She knows, so, and I already hate bag? Bonnie. D? What's in the bag, D? I told you, it's a surprise. Hey, D, when I'll we get back to camp, pull it with your you name. let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon. You like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but uh, D, that, that bag. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that away. Quit being so cagey about it. Me? Cagey? You two are the ones being cagey. Calm down, Dee. Just tell us where you found the bag. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. This is how all our fights go. Every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? We should dark? get moving I now. Come on, it's stopped. getting dark. But you are the one who made me stop. Here, regardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Hey, oh, I'm I about had it with that attitude. On. Attitude. And now we're standing in this goddamn rain, in this goddamn middle I know of nowhere. You Shut up, D. Leave Leland alone. This ain't your business, Bonnie. This is between him and me. Enough, D. He's right. We're acting like a couple kids. That's just because you ain't listening. Bonnie, darling, I'm I'm sorry we're... Darling! B, come on. Save it. I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours, too. <laughs> D, now's not the time. Bitch. Bonnie. Go to hell, Bonnie. This is the thanks I get after what we did for you. 
I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, God, run. Come on. We gotta move. What are you talking about? Walkers. Oh, shit. Or bandits. Uh, I'll be honest. I don't really give a damn. Yeah, I don't care about Bonnie, but I don't want her to die. That would be the last thing. She's probably like a drug addict or something. It's, they made it sound like she's a drug addict. Oh! That looked painful. Ah, oh, no, Walker! Really? That's all it took? Uh. Hey, it's our boss from uh, Vince's scenario. Interesting. Are we gonna end up on Herschel's farm? Was it like right there? This is kind of weird. It's like a never ending cornfield. Anything? No, I can't see a damn thing out here. Is that Steph? And Vince? Oh, it's, it's the guys from the Shell's chapter. Mama, watch over me. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. What is that? Can Find I use that? Weapon. That looks like a weapon. We got ourselves a weapon to go uh, whack this guy in the head. And it turns out it was oh, her. Oh, God, D, I'm so sorry. Oh, God. Why? You. Why? Do, do, do I love you? How bad is it? It was dark. It's so dark. I, I couldn't see you. I, I didn't know it was you. How was I supposed to know it was you? Mm. There, there was no... Mm. I saw that. I saw you. You... You did this. Oh, God, you killed me. You, you killed me. <laughs> I should never have trusted you. Just, just a junkie. You're gonna be fine, D. You're gonna be fine. Mm, liar. You did this for him. I, I, no, God, I'm sorry. I need him. I need you both. You bitch. Mary, you wanted him, didn't you? Thank you. Had the stones. Leland is just a friend. I didn't mean to do this, Dee. I swear to God. You fucking junkie. I agree with Dee. Dee. She's a junkie. Dee, did you find her? Honey, I, I thought they got you back there. Jesus. 
are you shot? Me? God, what happened? Oh, Jesus, oh, Lord, Bonnie, what happened? Oh, my God, D. Darling, what happened to you? I had to. I, I thought you I, would... What do you mean, Bonnie? What was that you just said? I said it was me that did this. I did it. Me. You did this? You did this to my D? She came out of nowhere. I thought she was one of them. I, I didn't see her until she was right there. I don't... I don't believe this. I don't understand. How did it happen? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Leland. Bonnie. Oh, I no, feel sick. Fine. Which way? There. I'm sorry to do this to you, darling. I'll leave you here. Call out if you this see way. I know it's hard, but I need you, Leland. I think I saw something over here. Die for this thing, I for damn sure ain't leaving it behind. She stole from those guys. And that's why they're pursuing her. What was that it? Was that it? Four hundred days in. Oh, okay. All right. We were right. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Oh, they're going to be happy to get rescued. So how many are we talking about? Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm going to try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. We're building a good community here. We want to keep it that way. Of course. So good. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Yeah, good luck. Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. You got it. Hey! Don't spit! <gasps> don't fucking move! Who the fuck are you? My name is Tavia. How did you find us? I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because you have to tell the truth all the time doesn't mean everyone else does. If I didn't trust people, I'd be dead. I know that for sure. People can care about you if you let them. Like Leland cared when he let you run off alone? That's enough, Becca. Guys, look. If I learned one thing from Danny, it's that we have to stick together and protect ourselves. What? That guy was an asshole. You should be happy he got killed before Shell and Becca joined us. Why? Don't worry about it. Wait, you find survivors? Do you find a lot? Not as many anymore, but... Well, we gotta go. Eddie might be there. Wyatt. Look, we need people, plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group, or split up, or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Well, I'm going. Maybe we should go too, sis. If Roman is still looking for us, 
He wouldn't be able to do anything to us there. There's no way that guy is still looking for you. We've been to that truck stop. There's no one left. Roman's not a problem. It's following her that'll get you killed. Look, I know it's a risk, but what else is there? If you guys are going, then so are we. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. Then stay here if you want. I'm not bringing anyone against their will. We only want people who want to be there. I don't understand what the problem is. Are you really considering staying out here? Foraging for food like fucking raccoons? I mean, then why did we even leave the photos there? Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. If we wanted to kill you, you'd be dead already. I had a gun and snuck right up. Well, what's stopping you? Exactly. Nothing. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? Yeah, I have to. I'm... I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. We have people of all ages in our colony. Teenagers, whole families. It's a chance to reconnect with people the way you used to. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? You don't. Oh man, that was crazy. Who's f oh, a lot of people shot off Justin. That's who it was. I thought uh, I couldn't remember his name. So we shot off Justin's foot. And did you stay in the car or get out? You went 50%. Okay, so I'm, I'm like with 50%. And did you stay with Nate or leave him? Oh man, a lot of people didn't trust Nate, but he, yeah, I wouldn't trust Nate. Did you lie to Leon? Oh, I was honest with him. I might have been a junkie, but at least I was honest. Did you leave the RV or kill Stephanie? 75% of players left in the RV. Well, I'm with the majority of people, except for uh, with Bonnie. I didn't really care about her scenario, but whatever. It was pretty short. I'm okay with that. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Stayed at the camp. Oh, man. Vince and... Freaking Russell. Yeah. Vince and Russell. They can make it on their own. And uh, Wyatt, Bonnie, and uh, Shell decide to go with Tra Travia. You know, people I don't really care. Vince and Russell, they can make it on their own. They're cool. I like them. I hope I get to play as their scenario. Okay, actually, Shell's alright. Bonnie, don't really care about Wyatt, and kind of grows on you a little bit. But I can go without him. I care about Russell and Vince. Those are the two people out of the whole entire group that I'm pretty cool with if I can just play their scenario in the sequel of uh, Season 2, you know. If I could see what happened to them, I'd be okay with that. 
Because Russell's man of Vince, well, Vince seems like he's pretty competent. Shell, Shell's kind of, I don't know, the linguist, the person that can communicate with other people. Bonnie, Bonnie's just a junkie. I don't really know too much about her. Her scenario is pretty short. It was all about, like, some sort of blood triangle thing and trying to escape and whatever. Uh, why, why it's just that stoner sure he's he's entertaining but whatever don't really care yeah what's done is done Nate's crazy and uh, yeah I guess I guess that was 400 days woo it was short but all together kind of equals one chapter so that, that's cool oh man I'm taking those are Nate's parents sad very sad. Oh well. So I guess we'll. I guess you find out what happened to them in season two. Not that I really know, but season two. Man, I. I I'm. I'm guessing that's. Uh, that's what happened to Eddie. You found a police officer. And uh, Nate. Well, that, that's fantastic. I wonder if he made it out alive. So, yeah. I don't know if I'm going to be playing Season 2. But, again, if you want me to, all you viewers who watch me play The Walking Dead, you know, feel free to just, you know, PM me, leave a comment. I don't even care. Just, just some way to let me know that you want me to. And if I get enough requests, I will totally do Season 2. Otherwise... I'm done with The Walking Dead. That's it. I'm just going to stick to Resident Evil 4 now. Alright. I guess this LP is over.